Hi, I'm Lee County Sheriff Carmine Marcino. When it comes to forensics, the smallest piece of evidence really can make the biggest difference. That's why our forensics division uses cutting edge technology to preserve every inch of our crime scenes in an interactive 3D model. Ferroscanner is basically just a tool that we use on crime scenes. It's for measurements and documentation purposes, and it's used for demonstratives in court. Basically what it does is collects measurements and data for any scene that we're scanning. We can pivot through. You can get up underneath the cabinets. You can see in the sink. You can pretty much go anywhere you want um, within the actual scene. We will collect the data on scene and then bring it back to the office and create a 3D demonstration of the scene that we scanned. The way the scanner works is it emits a laser. That laser bounces off the mirror that spins in the center of the scanner. That laser bounces off of objects and back to the scanner. It can't see through anything. So we move the scanner to see past other objects. So we'll move it through doorways, into other rooms, so that it captures the entire scene. It has the ability to scan in complete darkness, and that would be something that would be in black and white. But if there is a little bit of light, we are able to capture the color. Being able to have a 3D representation of the scene and be able to show people, uh, either detectives that didn't get a chance to come on scene, the state attorney's office, or even defense attorneys, it just gives them a much better idea of how the scene looked and how everything was laid out and where evidence was within the scene. Shots were fired from inside. They then came outside and exited the wall. So what we did, we placed targets on the one side of the trajectory rod and then a target on the other side of the trajectory rod. And you're able to see where the shots came from in this particular scene. And those are represented by the orange lines within the scans. And the scanner does have a built-in inclinometer and a built-in GPS, so it knows where it's at in time and space and in elevation. The scanning itself does take a very long time. If we're doing a higher definition scan, it can take around 20 minutes. Lower quality scans are going to be seven to eight minute scans. Typically on your average scene, we will probably do between 20 to 30 scans. So it's not a big time saver, but the accuracy of the data that we're collecting is, is much better. The field of forensics is always changing. We're always trying to keep up with the latest and the greatest. The Lee County Sheriff's Office definitely is on the forefront of that, and we definitely got a head start with our training and our experience with the Ferro Scanner. So it's been a great tool for us to have, and it's definitely going to be the future of forensics. From documenting crime scenes to retracing the path of a bullet, the 3D Imager is another tool our forensics division uses to solve crimes and keep you safe. Thank you.